YouTube, uh, I've been waiting for this for about six days, but I ordered it on the weekend. I'm kind of excited because the one on my computer right now is an AMD 810K. And this one is the 7890K, as you can tell from the title. I read some reviews saying that this one costs 143 but 150 163 around there online. Some people say it's worth it. Some people say it isn't. It has an integrated graphics card, so you don't need a graphic, a dedicated, um, dedicated graphics card um, if you don't want one. But I read that it's not great for rendering if you don't have a dedicated graphics card. But hey, uh, if you're just looking for a really cheap gaming PC that can probably edit 480p video, um, not the fastest, but you know around there, 480 is probably the max you're going to get out of this one. And if you do 720, it'll probably lag a little bit. I don't know. I'll do some tests. Um, I've heard some people say that you, it's not worth it. They're basically the same. But that's all subject of opinion because they don't know what exact rig you have. One rig may do this better than another. You know, it's just, again, all opinion. And here's my receipt. And here it is. It's the thing I've been dying to see. If I can get it focused more. That's it right there. The AMD A10 7890K unlocked for desktop. Side of the box. It comes with the Wraith Cooler. This special edition package includes the Wraith Cooler for near silent operation with Supernatural style. This box includes an AMD A10A processor, Wraith cooler, installation instructions, and limited warranty information. So if you don't know how to install a CPU or a GPU, whatever, this will teach you how to do it. Um, gaming performance is represented by a 3D Mark. There's the side that I'm reading it from. 3D Mark, 11 entry score, all performance by internal benchmarks, Done by AMD Lab with Radian R7 graphics driver 15, which scored 4,386 in a 3D Mark entry test. Performs faster than an Intel Core. Uh, sorry about that, my light just died. Intel Core i3 6320 with HD graphics. It performs faster than that one, just to make that clear. Uh, which scored, the Intel scored 3,095 in a 3D Mark 11 entry GV24 test. Additional hardware and software are required for the full enablement of some features. Not all features may be supported on all components or systems of your rig. Check with your component or system manufacturer for specific model capabilities. Copyright 2016. So it's only almost a year old, coming up on a year. Here's what it kind of looks like right there. Don't know if I can, there we go. Right there, it tells you the name. That's what uh, CPUs, GPUs, whatever look like. Made by AMD, AMD, sorry, AMD. Amazing performance at a great price. The AMD A processor offers the best in class gaming with high performance built in radiant graphics. Paired with the top of the line AMD Wraith cooler for a combo every PC enthusiast can be proud to show in their system, even though you never really show anyone these things. So there it is, there's a the barcode too. Got this online from eBay, and I know they're known for faking stuff. I bought it from a guy who said that he <laughs> owns a warehouse, but then I look at the freaking receipt, and it's from a Walmart. Um, always keep the boxes with your stuff. If you go to resell them someday, it's I don't know why. People are more likely to buy it if they see you have the box. Um, the better condition the box, the more they're willing to pay. And you know me, sometimes I'm not the best at keep. I mean, I try my best, unless you get a box like this, where it's near impossible. There we go. So it's still a good condition box. I might just sell the Wraith Cooler. They're selling for like 40 and 50 bucks. So I'll, I'll, I'll have only spent around... Oh, there it is. I'll have only spent around... Okay, 143 If I sell for 50 97 bucks around there. And I'll be making money back if I do find someone that will buy it. I don't see any instructions. Um, but that's okay. That's seriously, in my opinion, it's 
A-OK. -okay. So, <clears throat> I'm not going to open up the fan because, I'm, like I said, I'm planning on reselling it. But here is, if I can get it closer... Look at that beauty. It'll be my first time installing uh, CPU, GPU, whatever. Look at that luster. Right here, I switched to my phone camera. It's saying new CPU install. Please enter setup. Configure settings F1 to uh, run setup. I've only set up one computer with a new CPU, and that was years ago. So I don't know if it's changed. I hope it hasn't too much. Um... Okay. If I can get this to zoom in a little bit. There. It's a SUS. It's giving me a layout on my computer. Um save F ten. Okay. And then I believe it resets. Yep, it resets. I install it correctly. My computer's running a lot louder now because my AMD Athlon times four, eight hundred and ten, ran on three point seven volts. This runs on four point one volts. The seventy eight ninety K does. Hopefully, it doesn't ruin. Oh nope, it didn't. All my stuff is still there. And I don't remember how to change, since it has built-in graphics, there's a way to change it back to the, to whatever yours is. If you have a dedicated graphics card, there's a way to change it in the BIOS. And I'm going to have to probably do that, switch it back to my 750Ti. Because, like I said, some people said this made their stuff a lot faster. Some people said it was worse than the 750. Some people said it was better than the 750. So I don't know. 